good times, my name is Dari and today's topic is the difference between taking care of a baby and taking care of a pet. A lot of people mistake pets for babies. I know, I know. You want to see if you're able to take care of a baby. That is completely normal. Being a parent is not an easy job. You're not sure if you and your partner can handle such a heavy responsibility. And again, I agree. You know what? Come here for a second. Come on, come here. Taking care of a pet is not the same thing as taking care of a baby. First of all, getting a pet only for the purpose to learn how to take care of a baby is wrong. The way your mind is prepared for the new family member is not right. You're not seeing it as a pet, you're not accepting it for what it is and for its own way of being. You are simply forcing you and your pet to be something you are not. And in certain situations, like you uh, tell him something, like don't do that or do this, and he doesn't listen to you, every time you will doubt yourself as a parent. Even though in the future, if you have a baby, you might be a wonderful parent. But currently, you will doubt yourself just because of that situation. Reason number two. When you have a baby, it doesn't stay a baby forever, right? First it's a baby, you change the diapers and stuff, then it goes to kindergarten, school, it learns how to walk, how to talk, and sooner or later it becomes an adult. But when you have a pet, let's say a dog, because most people usually get dogs, let's say a dog lives about 13 years depending on the breed. Every day you will have to feed him, take him out, he might need a bath. This dog is completely dependent on you. So no matter what tricks you teach him, no matter how smart your dog is, in the end, it's still not going to be a fully grown adult who's going to take care of himself. He is going to need you every day and you will have to be ready for that. And last but not least, reason number three, if you are in an unhealthy relationship, getting a pet is completely um, insane. I remember we had these clients, they were a couple, they divorced and their dog was one week with the dad, one week with the mom. They both took amazing care of her, which made it even harder for her because you, she has to go to the mom, but can you uh, imagine how much she misses the dad? So don't put your pet in a situation where it will suffer. They do understand a lot and they're emotional creatures. Get a pet because you want a pet, because you want to take care of a pet, you want to give him love and you want to receive that different kind of love. You also should have a child if you want to, of course. And you should believe in yourself that you will take perfect care of your child and of your pet. I hope you like this video. If you have a pet, give him a big hug. Tell him or her that you accept them for who they are, for the precious animals they are. Until next time, follow me on social media, subscribe to my channel, like this video and share it with a friend. Links to my accounts will be down below. I wish you all the best. Bye!